talked about for a while, UConn is looking to expand housing options, specifically in the Hartford campus, and they cleared a big hurdle recently. They just got initial approval for a loan to convert some empty offices in downtown Hartford into dorms. NBC Connecticut's Kevin Geis is joining us live right now from the corner of Trumbull and Pratt Streets with all the details. Kevin, fill us in. Mike Gija, it's sitting vacant right now and totally dark on a Friday night here on Pratt Street, but the state's largest university is looking to give it life again. Those involved in the project say it would be good, not just for Pratt Street here, but for Hartford at large. When it came to looking for housing, what was that convenience factor? Like David Garces is about to be a UConn student. He's working at the Hartford campus, but will be studying in stores. He wanted to live in Hartford, but said housing was a challenge. Having the opportunity where people like can have that on-campus housing would be a great way for students to want to be here. More campus housing could be on the way for the capital city. The university and a private developer have begun the process to convert four floors of 242 Trumbull Street into roughly 200 suite-style dorms. So it'll be straight out and reconverted to a residential living environment. But Executive Director of the Capital Region Development Authority, Mike Framuth, says their housing committee approved a $10 million loan for the project on Thursday. The total cost is roughly $28 million, made up of a private mortgage and developer money, a state and local grant, and their loan. Well, there's a lot of elements of this uh, that play into more of a transformation uh, of the downtown core reflecting UConn's investments. Framuth says the project hits multiple aspects of Hartford's goals for the future, including adding housing, filling vacant office space, giving students local opportunities for jobs, and boosting business. Getting the students on Pratt Street, where we've done a lot of investment on retail, restaurants and things, uh, entertainment zone. The current goal is to have the dorms ready by the fall of 2025. The kids are going to love it. It's a no-brainer, and Pratt Street's a really good time. Some, like David McSurgy, excited just at the idea for future UConn Hartford students and the city. It would be the best thing for Hartford, best thing for the state. The project still needs more local and state approvals before it can officially move forward. The mayor tells us they will continue to work with the state and university leaders to grow Hartford's campus. Now, according to Framuth, if they can't meet that 2025 deadline, they will push it back just a year and try to open these apartments, uh, these dorms, by the fall of 2026. We're live in Hartford tonight. Giving guys NBC Connecticut News. Keisha, back to you.